In this video, I'm gonna convince you of why you need to learn to code. I talk a lot about the how of how I'm learning to code on this channel, but I've never really probably got into the actual reasons of why I am so excited about coding and why I am so serious about it. There are three main dimensions of reasons for why coding, I feel like is such a special skill. And I really haven't seen many people talk about all of these things. So I promise you, if you watch this video till the end, you will be so motivated to learn to code and you will just know if you are the person who decides to take coding seriously and to properly learning and to get good at it why it's so incredibly useful the first reason is that it can make you very rich if you just talk about the numbers it's no secret that software engineers can make a ton of money i made a previous video about the specific numbers in specific countries because it does vary a lot but essentially for example in the us if you work for one of the big 10 companies you can make like 150k straight out of university like this is a ridiculous amount of money to make straight out of university and obviously it only goes up as you get more senior with like five to ten years of experience you can easily make like 300 400 even 500k just by working in your nine to five job as a programmer and for a lot of people this is the reason why they take a programming because they want a job where they can make a lot of money and i don't think there's anything wrong with that now obviously money is in everything and you still need to enjoy coding and you still need to enjoy the job but i don't think there's anything wrong with being ambitious and really wanting to give yourself and your family the kind of life that you want because money is in everything but it can certainly buy you a lot of experiences it can buy you a lifestyle that you simply cannot have without it but okay, so software engineering is obviously not the only career where you can make this kind of money. There's lots of other careers as well, like investment banking, management consulting, law, where you can make these kinds of salaries. So what is it that actually makes software engineering so special against these other things? For example, an investment banker makes a ridiculous amount of money. Similar to software engineers, probably a bit more. But the thing is, to make this money, these professionals work with ridiculous hours. Investment bankers can work 80 to even 100 hours a week to make that salary. It's a similar story for law and a similar story for management consulting. For example, right now I am doing a management consulting internship here in Helsinki at McKinsey and the salary is pretty great. But the thing is, I work until 10 p.m. every single day. If you want to do anything else besides work, you just don't really have the time. It's been ridiculously difficult for me to have the time to keep making these YouTube videos, working this kind of job. So even though I could probably come back to McKinsey in the future as a full time, if I wanted to after this internship, I would much rather take my other job offer, which is as a software engineer, because even though this particular software engineering job has a slightly lower salary, those people don't work until 10 p.m. which leaves me time to work on other things like this youtube channel or the other thing that i wanted to talk about in the topic of making money with coding which is entrepreneurship if you think about really what are most kinds of new businesses on this day and age like most of the big new startups nowadays are technology companies and what do you need for a technology company well you need technology and what do you need for that well you need someone to create i.e code that technology or that app or that website or whatever your product is and the thing is if you know how to code you have the potential to create anything if you have an idea of for an amazing new app or an amazing new piece of technology you can do that if you know how to code so even though software engineers make a lot of money they have great lifestyle the real potential for you to make money with coding is if you are able to found your own business and coding skills in my opinion are simply the best skills that you can have if you want to found your own business so that is the real the real potential to make money with coding so when you think about when you combine all these three things software engineers making a lot of money then having a great lifestyle comparatively speaking to other professionals who make a lot of money and coding being really great for entrepreneurship what you can do is work as a software engineer from nine to five you get home at like five six you make dinner blah 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 and then you still have time to work on a side project which if it succeeds you can turn into a business like for example right now i already have this business with this youtube channel but even beyond this i want to do a lot of other things work on side projects and that kind of stuff if i work as a software engineer not only am i making a lot of money already from my job but i also have the time in the evenings to work on 
other things. And that's just something that you don't have with these other high paid careers. Like if I was to do consulting full time, for example, just no time for you to think about anything else other than work. And obviously you don't have to spend your evenings on a side project. I'd say that most people are perfectly fine with just having their job and then using that extra time to do like whatever life things. So if you want to have that, if you need that relaxation, a career in tech will give you that. Whereas a career in investment banking will not give you that. Hello darkness, my old friend. Okay, in case you can't tell, I'm actually pretty excited about this topic of learning to code. And in case I haven't convinced you yet, that's okay, because there's more coming. But in case I have, you might already be wondering exactly how and where you can start learning these amazing skills like coding. And if you are, then I have the absolute perfect video sponsor for this video, which is SkillUp. SkillUp by Simply Learn is a course and certification provider for the world's most in-demand skills. With over 150 free courses on trending topics such as data science, software development, AI, and machine learning. And what is more, all of these courses offer a certification for you to prove your skills, and the certification is also completely free. The courses are fully remote and self-paced, taught by industry experts, and they are specifically focused on building the strong foundational skills you'll need to make yourself a career in one of these fields. For example, I've recently become more and more interested in artificial intelligence, and I really want to learn this skill. So to my delight, SkillUp actually has a bunch of courses on artificial artificial intelligence, which I can just start doing by going here and clicking start learning for free and creating an account by connecting my Google account. And then I can just start watching the high quality lectures right away for free. So if you want to start learning one of these in-demand skills like AI, coding and a bunch of other skills, you can go check out SkillUp from the link in the description. Again, it's completely free, so you might as well go do it. So go to the link in the description and just browse their courses to see if there's anything that you might be interested in. And I want to thank SkillUp for sponsoring this video. And the second big category of why coding is such a great skill to learn is that you can teach computers to essentially help you and automate your life. And I made a video about this previously on how I'm automating my life using Python. It was just a one example of an automation project that you can make if you know how to code. But essentially, if you really think about it, a lot of other skills like PowerPoint or Excel are only useful in careers that use them. Like sure, you might be able to make some financial spreadsheet with Excel to like help you out live as well. But coding is really a lot more than just becoming a software engineer. Coding as a skill is useful in so many other areas beyond doing it professionally as a job. That's why people in many other fields, like even I've heard finance and accounting are actually encouraged to learn at least the basics of coding because it can automate some of the tedious parts of those jobs as well. And this is really one of the things that excites me about coding the most is having the power to create technology to help myself and it's just a cool feeling it's a really cool skill to have and really useful as well you can just create small things for yourself that save you time here and there and that's already amazing and it's amazing that we as humanity like anyone has the ability to just learn this skill and start creating these things this is super exciting to me if you can't tell and last but not least it is extremely intellectually stimulating. Let's compare again to my management consulting internship that I'm doing right now. It's a super exciting job as well. I'm not saying it's not, but the actual thing I'm doing on a daily basis in this job is PowerPoint slides. The work in the big picture is exciting because we are advising like large companies and that kind of stuff is very interesting and I'm learning a lot. What I'm most excited about the actual thing that I'm doing on a daily basis, I want it to be intellectually stimulating. I want it to be challenging for my brain where I'm really feel like I'm solving problems. And that is what coding gives me. And that's just another reason why I, at least I believe that I am more excited about a career in tech with coding than about a career in consulting, making PowerPoint slides. And you might not be like that. And if you're not like that, then coding might not be for you. But for me, I enjoy solving intellectually stimulating problems, challenging problems, logical problems, and coding and even broadly like math and other things like that are the purest form of logical problem solving. And that is really exciting to me. And when you solve problems like this, when you do that on a daily basis, it really improves your logical thinking skills. It improves your problem solving skills. I think it was Steve Jobs who has his famous quote, like everyone should learn how to code because it teaches you to think. And even with my very limited experience coding so far, or like mostly on my own, becoming better at coding and solving coding problems, I feel like it's like rewiring my brain to be able 
able to think more logically, to be able to think more coherently and to just be more logical, which is obviously useful in like every area of life way beyond coding. So are you convinced yet? that coding is a skill that you should learn? Well, if you are, you might be wondering how long is this gonna take? Learning a skill like this that's this amazing is gonna take you like three years, right? Because that's how long university degrees take. Well, it doesn't have to. If you wanna learn how I actually personally learned to code in four months and even got a job as a software engineer after just four months of learning to code from completely zero. I made these two videos. This video right here is sort of the chronological of what I did. It's the most successful video on my channel. And after that, there is this continuation video to it where I really talk about the how and like the methods that I used myself and the reasons why I was able to learn to code so incredibly fast and start reaping all of these benefits.